Hi, my name is Michael Squiggy and I do death sounds for video games. Well, I grew up in South Carolina, but in 2007 I came out to Los Angeles, an aspiring actor. I bleached my hair blonde like everyone does, and I uh, just tried my, tried my hand at it. And it did not work at first. The agents did not like me. They were telling me things like, your voice is doing one thing, but your face is doing another, so we don't, know, we don't know where to put you. Well, you know what they say out here, if your face don't fit, voice over it. So that's how I got into voiceover. Every voiceover actor has their niche, and mine just happens to be death sounds in the video game industry. <laughs> so death sounds are my bread and butter. That's true. <laughs> there are over 200,000 deaths a year in video games alone. That's a real statistic. So somebody has to do a voiceover for that. That's work. I feel like I had a natural knack for it, probably because I grew up on a farm and my dad used to make me slaughter the pig and the goats and all that, and so I heard them sounds and I sort of absorbed them. I think they just stuck in my head my whole life. Here's a few from the new Call of Duty. <laughs> One website said that I was the Joaquin Phoenix of uh, death sounds. So I'll take it, I'll take it. <laughs> you can find inspiration anywhere if you're looking. I was at a Sweet Greens last week and this little girl was choking on uh, broccoli and I just was like, lock that one away, that one's good. And I brought it in the studio and they loved it. They loved it. Don't worry, don't worry, she didn't die. They, they did the Heimlich on her, she was fine. <laughs> I scared y'all. I'm gonna do Sam from the new My Little Ponies game. It's very violent, which is very strange, but it's still PG. <laughs> Takes a lot out of you. That's, that's, it's not an easy job, but it pays very well.